what do Russian people know about Americans? What do they say? Today we're gonna talk about it. What's new in the whole universe? Yes, it's uh, Igor, Russian man who brings value to my own experiences. And today I will a little bit of uh, connect, gather all my opinions that I have around of the people of Russia. And I communicated a lot. I communicated with 35 plus uh, thousands, uh, 35 thousands plus uh, people for the last two years but I didn't communicate about America, but sometimes we had a topic about it. It means that I have at least 500 opinions about it and uh, in some different areas. And today we're gonna talk about 10 different things, about the Amazon delivery, about cheerleaders, about uh, workaholics and something like this. I have uh, my document of word where I wrote it and sometimes I will look at this uh, here and uh, I will tell all the points, okay? And before we start, like, to subscribe and comment where are you from what's the region of america maybe you are from florida maybe you are from uh, boston uh, maybe new jersey or maybe ohio or uh, win minnesota uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Is it correct state or not? But okay, California, Californication, let's go. First point of our talk, it is stereotype about, about workaholics. Workaholics are everywhere, everywhere who is working and like they're doing their stuff, they're going to the Bob the Builder things or maybe they are going to the like suit here, yes, and uh, they are going to the a court and doing lawyer things and doing some of the medical work or maybe teacher work because it is the best jobs uh, they are most paying things and uh, they go to this type of meetings entrepreneurship everywhere are stores and like always promotion promotion of the pee promotion of the poo promotion of the of this food of this uh, delivery things of this books of this ebook this uh, ebooks version of books and uh, also some of the books of in, in inside of the ebooks and some of this everything is paid and everything is like uh, Jesus Christ it is uh, the world of promotion and workaholics it is first opinion and uh, by the way before we start and continue it is opinion of all people and uh, it doesn't mean that we are angry for you it doesn't mean it it means that uh, yes some people things this way sometimes they do this because of uh, oh, it's funny really i think that workaholics it is a good thing and uh, some people say no it is they are workaholics you you understand it is all about our attitude you can say it with a funny face like you are a comedian or you can say it with uh, jesus christ i i hate them and jesus christ i don't want to be with this workaholics yes you understand it and uh, it means that we will speak in a positive way about all the stuff except of one second guns yes this one people in america has a lot of guns i i am against uh, no i don't want to say against but i don't prefer it in use against people I don't prefer it. Yes, we can use it, uh, but uh, I, I'm I'm in my religion of uh, that uh, I can accept everything, uh, uh, everything because uh, we can write books about it. But violence, it's not something that we want to accept. Yes, and uh, there are a lot of. Uh, guns in america everybody has a gun like 42 percent or 62 from 42 to 62 percent has a gun do you have a gun eh? let me know in russia we don't have so big opportunity to do this you should have super mega licenses one license third uh, th four fifth seventh and also license for what kind of use and also you should have a safe and also inside of it one more safe and also a paperwork inside of this safe and uh, safe i mean that uh, the box of secrets yes and it is second thing third third thing the best service workers in america it is uh, one of the stereotypes too we have that uh, everybody likes to go to not, not uh, like likes to go but every service job are good every like 
waiter is good in America. They are doing it because you have tips and uh, tips in American culture are everywhere. And if you are in Russia, tips, <laughs> what are you speaking about, man? N no, no tips. You will not have it. Uh, my the biggest tips. It is uh, that I will say thank you to you. And it's all in Russian language. Спасибо this way. And uh, you understand. And service workers are really nice and good service jobs in America. Nice. Like caring about people. And maybe not in a way like uh, caring uh, really soulfully, but they do nice job. Yes. And I hope you understand. Next. They are all fat. It is fourth stereotype. Fat or a best KFC, Burger King or maybe McDonald's, a Pizza Hut, some different types of pizza or maybe wheels, uh, uh, wagon wheels and also eating some of the sweets. I don't know names of sweets. Yes, Mars Snickers, but we have it in Russia, the Bounty, but uh, also some of the really de delicatess, delicatesses uh, you have maybe in your country and uh, the fact that uh, people think that uh, all American people are our best, but it is uh, kind of true. 25% of American population or ish, they are fat. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Next, uh, fifth point. It is uh, really a funny one for Russia, because in Russia it is so, like, censored. Nope. We, s we are saying no to rainbows and uh, with six colors and uh, LGBT parades are everywhere in America. It is one more stereotype. They think that uh, there are a lot of uh, LGBT parades that are gays, lesbians and some of the girls and uh, not everywhere, but always every weekend you have this LGBT parade and uh, uh, some people are <laughs> pushing in their asses and uh, <laughs> I, I will not talk about it guys but you understand it is like freedom country freedom for this LGBT parades too it is uh, maybe yes maybe no but I respect your rights everything is good and uh, you can do anything uh, <laughs> really and uh, in Russia we don't have so big amount of freedom through the government because uh, Russian uh, it is so totalitary and uh, mostly uh, it doesn't mean that your country may be not totalitarian in Russia it is more more totalitarian in China maybe even more in uh, North or South Korea I don't know North maybe they are more 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 most totalitarian yes it is all in comparing we know these facts Next, uh, all girls in college are cheerleaders. Yes, uh, I. it is my stereotype and uh, I, I believe in it. It is uh, really interesting because I was listening to Taylor S uh, Swift's song and I was w watching a lot of movies about cheerleaders, about some college, college in America and almost every college has a team of cheerleaders. In Russia we don't have these things because cheerleaders uniform is so expensive and uh, we not so expensive, expensive in, in many of the of the average person, yes. And uh, because we understand that uh, we can afford anything in our life. It all depends on our ambitions. ambitions. And uh, they are uh, like people in America. They are cheerleaders, girls jumping, doing some pyramids of, uh, <laughs> of uh, Illuminatis. And uh, they are doing some poses. And it is amazing. And also you have talismanuses. It is like a specific... I don't know, man or woman inside of the doll. Doll means uh, like high, high height doll with a head of the dragon or maybe head of manticore or scorpion or maybe it will be a lion head and also there are two you have. Is it true? Is it not? Do you have it? Did you have it? If you was in your college, please let me know. It will be interesting to know. Next, uh, large taxes. And uh, it is maybe you, it's maybe not a stereotype. You are really uh, like taxes for everything. 
taxes for breathing, taxes for eating, taxes for going outside of the home, going to this street, to that street. It is utriority, but you understand that uh, what I mean, that every taxes in Russia, taxes are maybe three times lower or something. Yes, right now we are going to the getting bigger because uh, I don't know why. It is need to think about it more, but some guesses, guesses right now that maybe country does it because they want to have more control. Maybe, maybe they want to to provide more value as they think, like government think that need to provide more value, and they think more more about it, and uh, maybe they know they know how to do this. Sometimes, yes, if it is uh, like government that cares about people they think that yes taxes for something better because we are smarter kind of yes and we are not lazy as people and we can do with money some good work it is like investments that we in then do something good but uh, we have opinions that uh, corruption can be to f find too and uh, yes it is some opinions about it next uh, Lord taxes Amazon delivery eighth point you have a lot of Amazon delivery and always all things that you have in re in your country are delivered like not uh, the opportunity to deliver you deliver almost everything and uh, there are a lot of deliveries I don't know but uh, I was uh, sitting in tiny chat tiny chat is uh, a specific website you can find it tiny as small yes chat chat communicating and tiny chat it is a website uh, almost people speak about cannabis and uh, i i don't prefer this talk and uh, some of the things of this nature of the girls they are speaking some naughty and uh, dirty talks they use uh, and uh, about uh, the amazon delivery yes you have in your country a lot of uh, deliveries especially of amazon yes maybe it is true because amazon is a huge company it is uh, i don't know first or second by net worth maybe more maybe less okay okay next ninth person ninth ninth point it is nothing personal only a business it is a quote nothing personal means that we don't have uh, please don't like this type of quote please don't uh, don't mind it is only a business like uh, all in america not all but uh, mostly it is like a business stock and it's a good nice nice thing sometimes because in russia we don't have the so big amount of understanding of, of business yes we have and entrepreneurship but in america it is mostly everywhere and what do, do i mean with it when you create a specific show or you create a specific like music or you create specific like selling you don't go personal you go for making some profits profits will be on others way not only on dough and uh, money and uh, but also on uh, stuff like happiness maybe it will be in creating community different benefits it all depends on entrepreneur who is the ruler of it maybe you have some things inside of you that i want to build a good community like people are smiling i like to see people smiling i am a sociopath and uh, like uh, you have this uh, type of things maybe you have a thing inside of you that uh, yes i want to make a dough i obsessed with dough and i want to make a make a house with dough and uh, yes maybe this type and uh, the most interesting what i've learned it is uh, even especially sometimes especially show business uh, are uh, in this type of quote that nothing personal it is only business because almost every song created in a way of making it everywhere like movies to hollywood is uh, the machine of uh, doing this stuff maybe pixar is not this type yes we can speak with different semantics about it semantics that means that different meanings verbality like you can say it uh, in a way of yes 
we are creating our company to make uh, people happy but in the some types of uh, minds you can say yes they are doing only money and that's all and uh, or maybe you can say we are creating our our fitness clubs to to provide you value with good opportunities to go to our places and uh, to do gyms because you can't do this at home because you are scared of your <laughs> siblings or something you can go to our place and you will be happy <laughs> and others people can say that jesus christ you are making some of the talk pep talk and that's all and uh, nothing else i hope you understand but in america it is uh, mostly or uh, everybody almost understands that it is only a business nothing nothing personal okay good in russia there are not so big amount of understanding and uh, you can say that uh, nope 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 it is all companies it is something bad and uh, nope i will not go to these places yes in russia they are thinking so way next 10th last but not at least and maybe one of the important you have good and even sometimes huge large old ages pensions pensions means that some dough that government pays you when you are old and please don't be so like right now no we don't have it we don't have it and uh, we have some small or maybe no 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 if we will compare with russia you have a lot of them and i w maybe 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 i was uh, it is all what i was reading and uh, russian people understand it too sometimes they say oh jesus christ so big amount in russia will you believe 150 dollars it is a pension pension 150 dollars a month 150 a month and compare with your even if you are like 500 dollars i will google right now one moment pension pension in america that's why you have a huge uh, taxes maybe it is why pensions history more various oh, one moment need to google a number number how much maybe need to google how much the average monthly social security benefit for each retired work comes to around 1413 or just under 17000 e an year 1413 it is like 10th time more 9 okay 9 and some point point 5 9.4 and uh, it is hugely you understand 150 and uh, 1004 yes maybe we can say that uh, you have prices uh, maybe bigger than in russia but you i i was reading about prices too and uh, your prices are three times more sometimes not bigger three times sometimes four times but the price is highly huge on it if you can save anything you if you know how to invest then you can use this opportunity and i don't want to convince you i don't want to like say that yes uh, you are kind of this way but it is all what i was learning and i want to be a friend with you and uh, i don't want to like make right now talk of uh, let's go warriors and uh, let's do wars here and <laughs> you are uh, y y uh, uh, these americans and uh, <laughs> yes this kind of rednecks talk in russian type yes russian redneck talk i will not do this uh, i'm not a way i'm not a person who wants to kind of break something i am doing it because i do content and i want to bring to you value maybe some entertainment maybe some of the curious facts it is all what we have in, um, in russia and i want to share it to kind of maybe inspire entertain or educate you in our russian way okay that's all it is what i want to bring value to you thank you a lot for watching this video have a wonderful day always improve so daily go forward and leave in the comment section, uh, comment section below what kind of stereotypes you have more about america and maybe what kind of stereotypes you have about russia it will be interesting to know your opinions yes some sharing caring and uh, see you next time bye bye